So we're gonna start this recipe off by putting some of these french fries in the bottom of a waffle maker. And these are checkers and rallies fries. And then you have to take some cheddar cheese and you have to kind of mix that up in with the fries. We're then gonna take a slice of American cheese and we're gonna put that right down in the center. And you guess it, we're coming in with a hamburger, cooked onions that I'm gonna put a little bit on top. And then we have some of these wonderful, already sliced up kosher dill pickles. We are gonna go ahead and throw a couple slices on top of the burger. And then we're gonna come in with some more of this American cheese, put it on top. And you guess it, more of the fries. So we're gonna go ahead and put more of the fries on top of the cheese. And then we gotta mix it in with some of the cheddar so they stick together. We're gonna close this bad boy up and we'll see you in a minute. Now while we're ready for this to cook, I'm gonna go ahead and make a dipping sauce. We're gonna take some mayonnaise and we're gonna go ahead and squirt that into the bottom, about that much. I have some red wine vinegar. We're gonna put a little bit of that in, some coarse black pepper. Go ahead and sprinkle some on there. Then we have some of these sesame seeds. A little bit of that. Any barbecue sauce you like, we're gonna go with the bourbon pecan. We're gonna go ahead and put a little barbecue sauce. And of course, we gotta have some ketchup. We're gonna squirt a lot of ketchup in there. And last but not least, some hot sauce. We're using the habanero stuff. You don't have to use it that hot if you don't want. Again, you can use any kind you want. We're gonna put a little bit in. Then we're just gonna go ahead and mix this together. Make sure it's completely combined. It should look sort of like this. And we're gonna put this in the fridge and we're gonna use this for later. Okay, it's been 10 minutes and we're gonna go ahead and open this up. Look at that, you guys. Oh my gosh, does that look good? So we're gonna actually transfer this, pick it up, and we're gonna put it onto a plate. And then this ring comes off just like that. Look at this thing. Oh my God, it's just literally encrusted with fries and cheese. There's a burger in here, I promise. And now we get to cut it open. You hear that? In for a treat. So here we go. Okay, you ready? Are you ready? Look at that, cooked perfectly oh my gosh now it's a fun part we bring in the dipping sauce that we have we set it on the plate i like to take some of this live lettuce okay but i like to rip off some of the leaves a little bit of the sauce on okay put a lettuce leaf on you don't have to do this part but you know got to get your veggies in somehow so this is it this is an amazing amazing burger you can make let's go in for the taste test mm, so good 